Hey, hey, so here's part five and it's Road to Crop Over 2024. So let's continue. So some things that I had to keep in mind prior to choosing a costume was uh, I was also going with a group of people and it was suggested to choose the same band so that we are at least close by on the road. And then one of my close friends that is going um, is experienced and was super helpful guiding me through the waves of options to choose from. So, so grateful for her. Love you, girl. So let's chat and let's break down what I was looking for and why I chose what I chose. So I wanted something that sparkled, that gave fairy, ethereal, cosmic, hedonism, and bright colors. So uh, that that was kind of the vision. So to reserve the costume, you need to register with the band. And when the band launched their costumes, you can have access to viewing the costumes. So they only require a deposit for initial payment to reserve. Okay, so when also when viewing the costumes and deciding the one for crop over, I know what I wanted for the template for any costume that I choose. So I wanted a regular bra that had padding as opposed to the wire wrap bras. I was looking for maximum comfort and support for the road. The wire bras are aesthetically better, but it may cost a little bit more to make. And there's also like a high chance of nip slips, which can be frustrating. And so I also opted for the high waist cheeky versus the thong style panty. And then also, I wanted a small backpack feather if possible and bright colors and sparkles. The feather backpacks are additional to the costume cost, so they're small, medium, and large backpacks for a lot of the costumes. So if wanting feathers, be prepared to pack and carry them back home on a flight with everyone else on the same flight as yours. So I wanted to feel and envision feeling comfortable in a costume because for almost a grand estimated price point, it should be everything it needs to be. So I saw, like basically, I will say that when I saw it, it was just the right amount of sparkle, accessories, and a beautiful, colorful combo. So stay tuned for part six so I can share which band we chose, okay? Thanks, bye.